Tonight we're continuing to follow that breaking news. We first reported in the WVLT news app for you. Traffic is back to normal after the right lane of I-40 East was closed for nearly two hours when this plane that you can see behind us here made an emergency landing on the edge of Interstate 40 East. This is what we looked at and what we saw when we got there. You can see it here too. The plane is being loaded up onto a wrecker to be moved off the highway. The pilot telling WVLT News the engine failed. As he was making his emergency landing, the interstate was busy as usual, filled with cars and tractor trailers. Even still, the pilot miraculously did not hit a single car and no one was injured. We spoke to that pilot just moments after making that landing. It's definitely a blessing. A blessing that no one was injured after pilot Frank Grubbs was forced to make an emergency landing on the highway. Grubbs, piloting a Zenith 750, explains when he knew something was wrong with the engine. I went through all my all the checklists to make sure that I, everything was as it should be, and I couldn't find anything that was, you know, wrong. But, you know, when I got it going again for just a minute, but then it quit again and that was it. That was the moment Grubbs knew he had to make an emergency landing and the only place he could was on Interstate 40 going eastbound. I just didn't have any choices because y'all looked around and trees and buildings and people and I was just trying to, so at least I just turned and I was going in the direction of the traffic so I could stay out of the way. He flew out of Sky Ranch Airport around 1 p.m. Saturday, and after less than 40 minutes of flight, the engine began to give out. Grubbs was the only person inside the plane, and no one was injured. Sergeant Thomas Clinton with the Knoxville Police Department explains how Grubbs was able to safely land. He was trying to make it onto the ramp where there was less traffic, obviously, but uh, luckily nobody was, nobody was involved with him, and he was able to land it safely enough to get him out and, and keep everybody else safe. So. Due to Grubbs' emergency landing, traffic became congested for several hours on I-40 going eastbound. I'm just sorry I backed traffic up so far. So. I inconvenienced a lot of people, so I hate that. 